Hello. Well, today I'm going to be uh, putting some highlights on these rocks, just using a cheap paint brush and a little bit of uh, white paint. I need to put some more in here later as I go on, but uh, start with that for now. I'm using what's called a dry brushing technique, and all that is all the, all the dry brushing technique is just put a little paint on your brush like that. Get some of the paint off there on the side of your cup. All I'm going to do is basically try to get as much paint off here. So it's basically virtually dry because you just want to add little highlights. You don't want to get it too white. So I'm just wiping it off on this newspaper here, just like that. And I'm just going to brush lightly over my rock face like that. Just to add very paint highlights on there. I'm sure maybe that probably took a little bit too much off and it's probably kind of hard to see. Uh, let me take a little bit more on. I don't want to put too much more on or else that will cause more problems. I'll zoom in here so maybe you can see it a little bit better there. All right, let me go hit this section here. I'm just doing, just going over it lightly like that. You can kind of see that. Get some of the highlights in the rocks there. Just very lightly over, just like that. And I think you can kind of see that a little bit better. Just brush very gently. It makes the edges of the rock kind of jumps out, makes a little bit more, it's a bit more of a 3D appearance, but the, it's a subtle but useful effect. Like I say, you don't want to have too much paint on your brush, just a little bit. You just want to add a little white to the edges of your rocks, just like that. So you don't want to paint your whole scene. And obviously some of the stuff when I sprinkle on my dirt is going to get covered up, but that's fine. Um, what remains exposed will have these little white highlights on them. And that just kind of brings out the detail. So uh, anyway, that's what I'm going to do now. And then after that, uh, I'll start putting on some dirt and put that in place.
dry brushing just uh, just really makes those rocks look three-dimensional. Detail is just kind of jump out at you. So I'm gonna let this dry and next up is putting some dirt on and some greenery. I think uh, slowly making progress here. Well that's uh, that's it for tonight.